Well, here we go again. Let's see what happened in June. What's up guys and welcome back to the channel, you're with Chris and today I'll be wrapping up the month of June where most of the time was spent within Brandon Sanderson's Cosmere and I'm tracking better than I could have anticipated in my Cosmere journey so that I am ready for the 6th of December when Wind and Truth Book 5 in the Stormlight Archive is released and I've said it before, I'll say it again that I am going to be part of that collective excitement upon the book's release and I'll be reading it on new release day, along with everyone else who is absolutely rabid over this book. And uh, the Dragon Steel Convention uh, in December, um, held by Brandon Sanderson, um, for all his fans, is going to go off its rocker, and uh, it's going to be a very successful campaign for Brandon Sanderson, I would imagine. Okay, so let's start how I always like to with some basic statistics. So I read five books in June. Now, 87.6% of all my reading in June was made up of Cosmere stuff. So uh, look at that. I've just been on a Brandon Sanderson binge for the whole month of June, pretty much. There were only two days at the end where I read something that wasn't written by Brandon Sanderson. Pages read, 2,753 average pages per day. This is frustrating. I'm sitting at 98 for the month of June. I can't quite seem to crack the 100 and the excuse I'll use is my nighttime reading where I get tired so I don't read as much. Oh, that's my excuse and I'm sticking to it. But um, yeah, I, I would hope one day to get over the 100 pages per day. Maybe I might be able to do that in uh, July. We'll see how that goes. Now my ratings for all the books, I had one five star rating, one four star rating, two four and a half star ratings and one three star videos uploaded i including shorts was 17 which is pretty productive for me the best performing video for june was my bookshelf reorganization with at the time of filming this was about 433 views which was uh, really really great no surprise there everyone loves to watch uh, bookshelves being reorganized and reshuffled around and then showing off the result in a bookshelf tour there's not a single person on the planet that doesn't like a good bookshelf tour on youtube the poorest performer, surprisingly, was my review for Edge Dancer, which got uh, 16 views. That was pretty surprising because I uh, made sure my SEO scores were right up there. Um, yeah, but it is what it is. Now, what I read. So I read the first three books of Mistborn Era 2. So I started off with The Alloy of Law. Loved it so much that I, I didn't waste time going into Shadows of Self, book two, and then The Bands of Mourning, which is book three. Now, the reason why I read them back to back and wanted to smash them out is because I wanted to be in time for my buddy read on the 17th of June with John from over at Talking Story. And uh, that brought me up to Oathbringer, which I absolutely loved as well and then uh, the last two days of the month were spent on Private Monarcho the latest book in the private series which I was pleasantly surprised with and there will be a review forthcoming for that one separately on the channel in the coming days now the highlight for the month not only was it my reading kicking into high gear but the real highlight for me was the buddy read itself with john we messaged back and forth pretty much every day on our progress on where we were at with the book and communicating our thoughts and our impressions and our wtf moments as we experienced them it was a really great experience and it hasn't ended there either we did finish up the buddy read and uh, now what we're going to do is talk about it on a live chat i will be going over to john's channel uh, in the third week of july to have a bit of a chat and it will be full of spoilers so it's going to be uh uh, fantastic to talk about and to uh, compare our notes on the live chat which will be fantastic really really looking forward to that which brings us to the book of the month and there's no surprise here it is Oathbringer by Brandon Sanderson book number three in the Stormlight Archive absolutely loved it it's a very clear winner although the first three books in the Mistborn Era 2 series were pretty good and I enjoyed them Oathbringer is just fantastic so much happened there it nearly broke me it made me laugh it made me cry it made me um, 
tense up because the climax was fantastic. Um, a separate review, a spoiler free review is coming out in the coming days for that as well. So make sure you look out for that one, which is going to go into a bit of detail on why I like the book. But uh, not an overly long video for my monthly wrap up today, guys. Um, it was a pretty good month. Uh, had me uh, nose down and bum in the air and uh, just got stuck in and um, achieved a pretty good goal of smashing out the first three books of Mistborn Era 2 so that I can be on time for that buddy read. And um, I nearly didn't get there, but uh, I made sure I did. And uh, what a whirlwind of a ride it was just to be reading uh, mainly Cosmere books for the whole month. It was just awesome. So now I'm taking a break from the Cosmere. I'll probably read Rhythm of War, uh, book number four, uh, in November when John reads it. And uh, in between then, there will be Dawn Shard as well, which is the novella that takes place between books three and four, which will be good. And uh, now at the moment, I'm just concentrating on shorter books and palate cleansers because after reading something like Oathbringer, you do need a palate cleanser or to uh, to uh, yeah just clear that palate and um, I've got uh, quite a few short books lined up and I should smash through them pretty quickly so uh, there you go guys thank you very much for watching that is it for my monthly wrap up of June bring on a great month for July I feel it's going to be a fantastic month a very productive month on the reading front and can't wait to uh, smash out some books please don't forget to like and subscribe offer up any comments below as always I'll respond to that I'll promise to deliver the best content I can but until the next video guys happy reading